Youth from foster care are statistically California's most vulnerable demographic, but you can help. The more healthy relationships a child has, the more likely they will be able to recover from trauma and thrive. Aging Up is empowering youth from foster care and is being recognized for their acts of human kindness by Dignity Health. Here to share more about the youth mentoring program is the Aging Up co-founder and communications director. We have April Johnson. Hey, April. Hi, thank Hi. You for having me. Yes, happy to have you back on. So April, how many years strong has Aging Up been around now? Well, that's a tricky answer. Um, <laughs> officially, we founded in 2016, but we spent the first two years uh, really finalizing program development and recruiting our first cohort of mentors. Okay. Uh, so youth joined us in 2018, so we celebrate that, and we've been going strong for five years okay, now. Okay, five years, that's an exciting amount of years. So you are one of the co-founders of Aging Up. So what ha was the drive for you to create this organization? Yeah, so, um, you know, my parents, I, I grew up fortunately in a two-parent loving household. Um, a very different upbringing than what my parents had. And so they broke the cycle of abuse and neglect. Mm -hmm. And um, then we're involved in youth ministry. And so, you know, I was a young youth leader a lot in my teen years, uh, fresh out of college, or during college, I interned at the foster adoption agency. Oh, wow. And really early in the 2000s, a lot of research was going into adversity and trauma and what is the key factor in helping mm -hmm. young people recover from that. Mm -hmm. And the conclusion was, stable, healthy, supportive adults. Mm -hmm. And it just seems so simple. Uh, so at that time I was working at the foster adoption agency and they had a program, a mentoring program, but they did not enroll youth over 12. Mm -hmm. And so there was kind of a need in Sacramento of someone needs to mentor youth in foster care. Mm -hmm. And a colleague and I kind of had the circular conversation that eventually it was like, well, I guess it's us. Yeah. <laughs> so yeah. that's essentially how I up started. Yeah, well, I think it's beautiful that you found that need that needed to be fulfilled and really you and your other co-founder put the magic and made it work and now Aging Up has been here five years strong. What would you say have been the highlights for you at Aging Up? Yeah, there's so many. I mean, the, the great thing is just seeing the youth. You know, some have been with us from the very beginning. Mm -hmm. And so we've seen them as, you know, eighth graders and now young adults living independently. Um, you know, carrying jobs and going to school. Mm -hmm. And you've been recognized by Dignity Health for your acts of human kindness. Why is it important that each of us make an effort to show kindness to one another? Yeah, you know, kindness is so important. You don't know someone's background. You don't know the day they're having. And so a smile, a kind word, it really does go a long way. Mm -hmm. And it's those, you know, our mentors do those small acts of kindness and open world views and really, um, it just creates value and helps people you know, walk differently, engage differently. Mm -hmm. And so simple acts of kindness add up and they matter tremendously. Yeah, I, I completely 100% agree with you. No matter how small or big the act of kindness is, the fact that someone's just going out of their way to show you a little bit of kindness really means a lot to people. Exactly. And today is Giving Tuesday. So can you kind of explain to our viewers exactly what that is? Yeah, Giving Tuesday is one of my favorite days of the year. It's just, um, it started as a grassroots movement in 2012 in New York City and exploded into this global movement of generosity and kindness. Yeah. And, it, you know, generosity comes in many forms. And so we're encouraging people to give their time, voice, or dollars. Uh, and, you know, that's volunteering, it's acts of kindness. Simple things like liking and sharing positive messages on social media, mm -hmm. and then obviously donating. Uh, but it's just a great day. It was intended to start the Tuesday after Thanksgiving mm -hmm. as a kickoff to the holiday giving season. Mm -hmm. And it just brings, you know, what the season is really all about. Yeah. It's about, you know, community and um, helping your neighbor. Yeah. So for our viewers who want to give this Tuesday, how can they do so with Aging Up or any day if they want to? Yeah. So all of our information and there's a Giving Tuesday highlight right on our website at agingup.org. Alrighty, all helpful tips. Thank you so much. This has been amazing, and I'm glad we're able to talk about Giving Tuesday. It's today, guys, so make sure you help out with Aging Up. Thank you. <laughs> of course, and you can visit the website agingup.org with a Giving Tuesday highlight right at the top, like April mentioned. We hope you too can give and share a small token of human kindness to someone else.